go back to the next question. The worst pickup line you've ever gotten. Worst pickup line. I think it's one from one Igbo guy. Ne how far? <laughs> I think it's from one Igbo guy. Ne how? All I feel is blue. Hello. Hi guys. Look who we have. <laughs> Look who I have here, Brenda. Hi. Why hi hi? Why are you acting all nice? Like she's not a nice person, no, you guys. She is not nice. I'm the nice girl here. Anyways, today, today we are going to be doing the tag, um, get to know me tag. And she'll be asking me questions and I'll be answering her. I know you want to know me better because I'm a very nice person, like I always say. Nice girl. Melody with nice girl. Jesus. <laughs> My God. <laughs> anyways. Anyways. She'll be asking me some questions and I'll be answering her. So you guys can get to know me better. So, Brenda. Yes. Hit me. The question. Yup. 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 Hit me. Okay. Your full name. Because I highly doubt it's Melody Jacob. Just like that. <laughs> My name is Melody Jacob. I have another church name. Uh-huh. God is able. My father calls me my God is able. And my father, my pastor calls me my God is well able. So your that's ni- it. Your Nigerian name. Like, what do you guys want to use my native name for? <laughs> like, seriously, I don't want. I don't want. Don't know it. Fine. Bye bye. No, 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 no. I don't want. No, no, no. Go on. Next question. Which one is that one? No, no, no. Go, go on. Go on. Next question. No, they don't need to know. Do you guys want to know? If you want to know, uh, no, you don't want to know. See, next question. Um, how old are you? Okay, for this question, it depends on how I'm feeling. If today I'm feeling 22, I'm 22. If I'm feeling 21, I'm 21. If I'm feeling 24, I'm 24. So I don't have a specific age. Yeah, you ask me, what is the age on your passport? Yeah, what are you saying? Yeah, I don't care about that age. That age is not for real. The age that is for real is how I'm feeling or how I feel every day. So that's my age. Today I'm feeling 21. So 21 is my age for today. <laughs> All right. Hit me with the next question, girl. First thing you notice about someone you meet okay well girl a girl okay, girl. you know there are a lot of beautiful girls i notice your beauty and the way you carry yourself because i if you have self-confidence you draw me very close to you so i notice how your attitude and everything is so for guys your dressing and also your attitude yeah okay what do you hate about people that annoys you the most what do I hate about? About people that are noisy the most. Noisy people. I can't even hate on noisy people because I'm very noisy and loud. I talk a lot. I'm a talkative. And this YouTube thing has even made me more... Like, I talk, 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 talk. So, I don't hate you guys. We are on the same... Level. Uh, yes. Okay, so, are you single or married or... Engaged I am married. I am married to Jesus. Satan, leave me alone. I'm married to Jesus. Satan, leave me. <laughs> Guys, I'm married to Jesus, and that is the best husband you can ever have. Hit me with the next question, girl. Okay, which one do you prefer, cats or dogs? I don't like animals. No, fly, cock, hen, tiger, lion, crocodile. I don't want. I don't want any pet. Just leave me. Just leave me with my. What is wrong with this YouTube thing? Why is he coming up and playing right now? <laughs> so I don't like. I don't. I don't like pets. I don't want to keep any pets. I don't like it. So um, cat, dog, crocodile, all of them. No, I don't want. No. No, I don't like it because dog has smell. Dog has smell, and then the smell. I, they'll be like, um, I take care of my dog, but no. For me, each time I go to a house that that you know that has this um, kind of cat, pet, um, dog, it's like. I, I I feel very uncomfortable eating your food or drinking water because most of the one that see let me tell you one secret. If you're my friend now you have a pet, let me tell you why I don't come to your house. <laughs> now this is the reason why I don't come to your house because I don't feel comfortable. And the one that paints me is when you how let me even t- tell you the story. Oh my god. I went to one of my friends' place and she has a cat. Do you know that she was like she's going to cook, let's eat. I was happy, I was so hungry and 
you know, when she was cooking, do you know what happened? She would kiss the cat, touch the body of the cat, then she would cut onion. Girl, I wanted to die. I wanted to die. I said, Jesus Christ, how will I escape from this place right now? I said, God, I need to formulate a story why I will not eat this food. I was like, oh my God, people should just kill me. Let me die. Do you know what I did? I stepped, I, oh girl, trust me. Abba girl, no, they carry last. Boom. Do you know what I did? Oh my God. I actually lied to the girl that I'm having running stomach. Mm-hmm. I was telling saying that God, girl, I need to go home. My stomach is pain. She was like, No, I need to eat if I'm having if my no if I'm having um, pain. Mm-hmm. I didn't tell her I run into my cat. I told her I was having pain. She said I need to eat. I was like, No, that no, no, no. When I have this stuff, I need to go and take my drug at home immediately. And that's how I left. Girl, please, if you have cat or dog, stop kissing them, calling them different pet name, this one, that one, and they'll be kissing them. How do you even do that? Guys that have, or girls that have, like, partners that have this, and you'll be kissing, mm, mm, you not kiss the boy too, kiss the girl. Man, you're your own, no. See, if you get sick, you're your own. All this, it's not cute. I don't like it. For me, it's not cute. All this, it's not cute at all. At all. I don't like it, please. Girl, please, go over to the next question. Don't keep pets. Man, I don't like it, please. Oh. Favorite color? I like blue and I like red, Ooh. red, red. Lady in red is dancing with me. Anyways, guys, I can sing very well. Just forget about this whole thing. I can sing very well. Okay. Mm. What would you describe yourself in one word? Confidence. Okay. What do you like about Ukraine? I like the cheap restaurant, the cheap lifestyle. Yeah. I hate the weather. <laughs> So much. I hate cold. Which weather? Which weather? I hate winter so much. <laughs> oh my god! It oh makes me sad. I have mood swing. All this summer is bare, and I can't wait for summer to make my hair, fix my nails, lashes. You know, always look flick. So. But, but the snow is beautiful. The snow is beautiful. Will I eat the snow? <laughs> I don't understand. Will I eat the snow? It, it's just beautiful. You know, when the snow just. The first week of, of winter, it's really pretty and nice, fun. But after then, man, I just want summer, 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 summer. Summer, you can wear what you want. But winter, you have to cover up. Before you go downstairs to just meet the pizza man, you have to dress up. Like, everything is just so stressful. Please, no, 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 no to summer. No, 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 I beg, no. Okay, what do you mean? Not to winter, not summer. No, not to winter. You said not to summer. It's a mistake, not to winter. <laughs> okay, what are your best cities in Ukraine? Oh, wow. I love Lviv. Lviv is really nice, and you meet a lot of foreigners, and you know have a lot, food. Uh-huh, the food, music, the street is popping, vibing. Everybody's happy. You know, you meet a lot of people that can speak English. But uh, another one, I like Dnipro because I have a lot of friends there, and you know a lot of memories there. Shout out to my friend Natalia, I love you. Mwah. So I have a lot of friends <laughs> in Dnipro, <laughs> and also I love Kharkov. And my worst city, you want to know? Yes. Kiev. I don't like Kiev. Don't ask me why. I don't just like Kiev. <laughs> Let's go. I don't like Kiev. <laughs> okay. What is the most embarrassing thing that has ever happened to you in Ukraine? The most embarrassing thing that ever happened to me in Ukraine? Yeah. Oh, wow. That's a tough question, but I'll try to answer it. I need to pick one. There are a lot. Wow. <laughs> Yeah, there are a lot, but trust me, I'm a strong girl, so... Okay. Um, mm, mm, mm. Should we start from the magazine, my GTB card, messing up. I finished packing a lot of stuff in Caravan Market. I finished buying, I was buying, everybody was even looking at me like, look at this rich girl, she's buying a lot of stuff. I was just buying, I, you know, feeling myself, I was well-dressed. And when I got to the casa, man, they swiped my GTB card, dude. They said, um contact something something man i wanted to faint the guy near me was just there he was looking at me like this i was like hey this girl <laughs> today i don't fall my hand like man it was so embarrassing like very 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 embarrassing that was one of and there were a lot of people in the queue so they were just looking like what is happening you know you know when you have your baskets everything is filled like they're looking at like yo 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 this girl you know she has money she's buying a lot of things and they're wondering are you the one that's, that's going to eat everything here and you don't even care you're dressed well you and then the card just messed me up. Well, you know what I did? I just told the security man to carry the um, stuff back and they checked it in back and I went home. 
I went home. Luckily for me, I had transport money and everything on me, but I didn't have... I was trying to use my GT Bank card to pay, and it didn't work, so that was one of the most embarrassing moments. I have another one when I went to... Um, I went for one conference at... Um, it was It was in my dad's company. I went there, and it was for students that are about to enter into the university. I went there, and that was around the first time of me seeing my my monthly flow. And you know that instead of me to tell my mother that buy me pad, shame will not allow me. And this, let me tell you something. This particular thing is not because of I cannot tell my mom. It's because my mom will start advising me. Oh my God! If you touch a boy, you will carry belle. If you do this one, so I was just like I don't even want those kind of stuff. My mom will not ask you. Now you're developing breasts. This one, I was just tired. I just I was like, no, I don't want this kind of talk. Do you know I went to that conference and sat down for like four hours. The chair was a pool of blood and I could not stand up till everybody left that hall. And one girl just came and met me like, how are you doing? And I told her that, please, my clothes is stained. She was like, oh my God, this don't worry, I'll bring you something to cover yourself. And she helped me. Shout out to you. I don't know you, but God bless you so much. God bless you. Thank you so much. Thank you. I love you. Yay. Hit me with the next question. Um, one thing you like about your body and one thing you hate about your body. Well, to me, I'm perfect. You know, I don't think that God can make us imperfect, but I appreciate the fact that I am a very beautiful lady. I have a good character also. And one thing I don't like about myself is that I, I'm trying to manage anger. I really get angry really fast, but it's better now. So we grow every day. Yeah. What do you dislike about Ukraine? Racism. I don't like racism. And that just, it, it makes me, like, this is something that breaks my heart. Seeing somebody thinking that, look at how beautiful and nice I look. You think you're better than me. Like, how? How do you, how do you even get to that level of thinking that kind of stuff because i'm black or i'm from africa i don't like racism for me you can intimidate me if you carry racism near my side i will show you say <laughs> maybe all big men they wear abada i will jaga jaga you <laughs> so don't even bring racism close to me so i don't like racism because of ukraine like that's one thing i don't like about ukraine sorry what is the best pickup line a guy has ever used? For me? Yeah. Do I even allow them to talk? <laughs> Do I even allow them to talk first of all? Anyway, let me even think about one. They always say you're beautiful, you're beautiful, you're beautiful. I like your blog, I like uh, your body. Your, I like your body structure. So I'm like, yeah, I think you're beautiful. I have to check my Instagram because none of them walk up to me. They always send me DM. Stop DMing me, I don't like it. Stop sending me DM. I don't like it. Go back to the next question. What's the worst pickup line you've ever gotten? Worst pickup line. I think it's one from one Igbo guy. Nehalfa. <laughs> I think it's from one Igbo guy. Nehalfa. I, I don't know. I don't know. I think. I don't know. I can't remember. I can't remember. Okay. Your best movie. Oh, my best movie. Queen of Catway. Catway, right? Yeah, Catway. That's it. Yeah, Queen of Catway. That's the pronunciation, I think. Queen of Catway. You should see that movie. It's so nice. Lupita acted, mm. and it's so nice. Oh, my God. Everything about the movie is so beautiful. And I could connect to the movie because it's something that happened, like, around us. So, see the movie if you haven't. Okay. Would you ever get a tattoo or a nose piercing? Well, first of all, my parents, my mom. <laughs> if I think oh, about it, she'll kill me. But at the same time, I don't really <clears throat> like um, tattoos. So no. For nose piercing, no also. And I think I'm okay with just this one. So, yeah. If you would have said yes, I would have asked you another one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. What was your favorite and worst subject while you were in university? Well, well, well. I liked agriculture and economics. Uh, I was doing. I was one of the best students in economics. Yeah, and I like agriculture because then after we f- the agricultural students, we go to the, we have like the 
they give us a portion to farm cassava and then when we harvest it we make this um i don't know what they call it if there's any um, english name do you know tapioca i don't know if there's any english name for it do you know what tapioca is anyways if you're in nigeria you know what tapioca they used to make abacha like they will slice it and mix so we harvest it and we make from cassava then so it's like fun for me so i like economics and agriculture what beauty hacks do you hate the drawing of your eyebrow <laughs> now i don't i hate like it some people do it really well but some people do it do um uh, it's so harsh and you look so old and wicked and you know like this i don't like you that one and, I, and another reason why i don't like it is because i can't do it i can't do it i don't know how to draw my eyebrow and i feel like i've watched a lot of youtube videos it's like those girls are just doing magic like i don't understand i don't know i don't know maybe the, maybe it's not for me so i don't like when people draw their eyebrow really harsh and like this i don't like it okay what natural also hair yeah tip or i think hair tip or hair hack do you think is overrated well as an african queen okay. and a naturalista okay <laughs> oh my god <laughs> i moisturize my hair with water every night before i sleep every night before i sleep i think for me water is best moisturizer so i spray water on my hair before i sleep every night and look how healthy it is glowing you know you know no that's it yeah i moisturize my hair with water so moisturize your hair don't stress yourself don't be doing this one buying this product see if your hair will grow it will grow don't be yeah don't be stressing yourself if you don't have a good hair just manage it I don't know. I don't know what to say. I don't know. But I have a very good hair. My family have really nice hair um, kind of growth. So don't be jealous of me, baby. <laughs> so we have very nice hair. So that's why. So. People forget genetics. Yeah, people forget genetics a lot. Yeah. Okay. What do guys do that you don't like? Like guys, male, male guys yeah, why are we talking about those people self i'm tired of you people i'm tired <laughs> tired of you people people are very frustrating guys <laughs> ah don't stop me because you gave me direction you not say i need your number i don't like it you cannot help somebody without asking for anything what's your problem i don't like it better stop it anyways that's one of the things guys don't there's no free lunch i don't know why 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 do you guys always expect something in return why Okay, so do you? Oh my God! What do I do? What <laughs> do I do? What? Okay, which one do you prefer? Um, oh my God! Say it! <laughs> Say it! <laughs> Look at this foodie. Do you like it? Do you like it? Do you like it? Do you know you can get it? <laughs> Oh my god shout out to this brand and this brand is i forgot the name rufina. so it's rufina rufina brand i'll leave the link below yeah so you can just go and purchase it's very warm for winter and you can also wear it during spring so here it is it's going to be on a replay if you're on my snapchat you know i like I mean, something is really comfortable so rufina or replay on my snapchat you see me wearing it every day so so this is my get to know me tag and if you enjoyed it or you hate it too just subscribe <laughs> <laughs> subscribe yes, to my youtube channel and share so get to know me if you want me to do another video any type of video you want me to do just let me know in the comment box below and i'll do it very nice girl like i always say so have a lovely 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 day bye bye from melody and brenda brenda <laughs> Alright, bye guys, bye. Bye. <laughs>